This is going to be a very fast paced video so we'll put the complete recipe and the cooking times on your screen before the video ends so that you can pause the video when you are shopping for the ingredients or when you are preparing the recipe. Now even though we don't have to soak these beans we are going to rinse them and inspect them for debris like stems or any kind of critters that might have got put in the bag during the production process. We're going to use chicken broth here, but if you don't have chicken broth, you can use bouillon cubes and water. Now we can put the beans in and two bay leaves along with a medium onion cut into big chunks. If you don't cut it into big chunks, it's just going to disappear during the pressure cooking process. We're going to use this very cool vegetable chopper to make equal size vegetable chunks for our soup. If you'd like to purchase one of these vegetable choppers, check the video description for an affiliate link. Now one of the good things about using a vegetable chopper for potatoes in this particular recipe is that we will know when the potatoes are done because all we have to do is check one and since they are relatively the same size all the potatoes will be done. Once the vegetables are chopped we're going to add some water to keep them hydrated. We'll set the onions off to the side. We're also going to use a large pre-cooked ham steak cut into big chunks. Now we are going to do a manual pressure release when the time is up on the control and you might want to put a cloth towel over the vent in case the beans foam up and want to spit out at you. Now we can add the rest of our ingredients. But before we do that we're going to remove the bay leaves. We're also going to add some salt, some pepper, and some garlic powder. Now we can stir everything up and set the control on saute and bring it to a boil for at least five minutes. Since the ham is pre-cooked, all we're trying to do is cook the potatoes. And remember, they're all the same size, so all we have to do is check one. All right, let's have a taste. Mm -mm. Well, there you go, folks. A very easy, delicious, hearty ham and bean soup. Now, if you learned something here today and you think your friends might like this recipe, please share it with them so you can help us grow the channel. Thanks for watching.